Welcome back to Carson Tate's video log. Here we are live and just outside of Provincetown, and I have the famous, the amazing Radcliffe. Say hi to your studios. <laughs> hi. Um, so we're just finishing up Women's Week. We've finished the Bull Strips events, and why don't you just tell the audience um, what you did here while we're here and why Women's Week is so important? Well, this this was the 25th anniversary of Women's Week, which. Um, celebrates lesbians coming together in community. And Provincetown, I think, as I mentioned uh, a couple of days ago, is historically the place where the disenfranchised, the adventurous, and the daring congregate. And that's why Bold Strokes came this week. And that's why Provincetown is kind of the setting for some a major series you have. Yeah, the Provincetown Tales. And you have a new book out in that series? I do, <laughs> Tiny Tides. Okay, so what's special about that book to you? Well, every Provincetown book is special to me. Because I love this place. When I get here, I want to write. When I come down the hill from Truro and I see the harbor, and I see the monument, I'm ready to start writing. So it's a special place to me and it's exciting and I think that it's inspired artists for years and it works for me. It's very inspiring to me just being here and seeing the sense of community. So what do you have next on tap? Uh, I'm doing a new series. Actually, I'm writing under a new pseudonym, L.L. Rand, and I'm doing a paranormal series which has an entire uh, new host of beings and hopefully it will be very exciting and very sexy. I heard a reading from this, uh, your first book in the series, it's called Midnight... The Midnight Hunt. The Midnight Hunt, and it was amazing. I think everybody's going to be really excited to see it. I hope so. Okay, well thanks a lot, Radcliffe, for joining us here on the video log, and we appreciate you being here, and appreciate you making all of this possible. Thanks. Thanks.